to ensure optimal performance and safety in the operation of your Holland fifth wheel. Take a moment to learn the proper uncoupling procedures. Holland FW35 series fifth wheel uncoupling procedure. Make sure that the trailer is on a flat, level surface, capable of supporting both the trailer and its load. Straight alignment is very important. Pulling the tractor away from the trailer at an angle has the potential to damage landing gear. Engage the trailer parking brakes and back slowly into the trailer to relieve pressure on the fifth wheel locking mechanism. Engage the tractor parking brake while the fifth wheel is applying pressure to the kingpin. With air ride suspensions, make sure you do not exhaust the suspension before uncoupling. Exhausting the suspension before uncoupling will make the uncoupling procedure difficult and could damage the fifth wheel and kingpin. Chalk the trailer wheels. Now lower the landing legs using high gear until the landing gear pads touch the ground. Do not raise the trailer off the fifth wheel. Now disconnect air and electrical lines from the trailer and secure them to the tractor. Release the optional manual secondary lock if the fifth wheel is equipped with one. Now pull the release handle to disengage the fifth wheel locking mechanism. If the fifth wheel is air release equipped, lift and hold the fifth wheel lock release toggle switch for a minimum of three to four seconds until the locking mechanism opens and locks in place. You may then release the toggle switch. The operation of your fifth wheel air release may differ from the procedure shown. Check with the tractor OEM for proper procedures. Make sure the release handle is pulled out as far as it can go and that the lock mechanism is fully released. The yoke shaft, nut and washer should be in the out position. Return to the cab, release the tractor parking brake and slowly pull the tractor forward 12 to 18 inches to disengage the kingpin. Do not pull the tractor out from under the trailer. Once again, engage the tractor parking brake and place the transmission in neutral. Exhaust the air from the tractor suspension. Inspect the tractor and trailer to make sure the fifth wheel is below the upper coupler plate of the trailer. If, after the air has been exhausted, the fifth wheel is still in contact with the upper coupler plate, use the landing gear to raise the trailer off the fifth wheel. Also, be sure the landing gear is fully supporting the trailer. Return to the cab, disengage the tractor parking brake, and pull away from the trailer. You may now air up the tractor suspension to ride height. The uncoupling procedure is now complete. For coupling and slider repositioning, refer to the Holland Coupling and Slider Positioning videos.